Hey guys, Ryan here with BoxGuard Security. In this video series, we're going to take a look at our Honeywell Vista 20P programming section by section. Let's take a look. Okay guys, and now here we are back starting at field 59. <clears throat> continuing our Vista 20P programming. And we're going to continue here and pick up where we left off on the last video. Star 59 is your exit error report. Typically we were going to input a zero for that guy there. Now, some of this will depend on whether or not you're being monitored. And some of this will be for a uh, self-monitored system. However, typically, uh, if you're having a monitored system, this is how it would be programmed. If you're being monitored by a central station that's going to get reports and contact you, uh, this will vary from system to system. This is just one way to program it. This isn't the only way. This is the way that we typically do if it's a monitored system. So I'm going to walk you through this now. Trouble report code 1 zero. Bypass. We're not going to send um, signals if anything is bypassed. So that would be zero, zero. AC loss. Zero, zero. Again, that will depend on your monitoring station. If you enable AC reporting, typically that will flood your central station with power outages and they'll get thousands of signals from um, locations all over the power grid at the same time. Um, so we don't need to know when the power goes out. Stuff like Total Connect uh, will let us know that and that's typically not crucial unless it's a high security system. 63 low battery, we definitely want to know that so that's going to be 1, 0. If we're on test, yes, 1, Zero. Open report. Don't need to know. Zero, zero, zero. Armed away and armed stay. This will be six zeros. Three separate entries. Zero, 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 zero. zero. RF transmitter low battery. The star 67. And that is going to be one zero and what that will do is enable your system that if one of your wireless contacts battery goes low over time um, it will let the system and the central station know and they'll get a, a signal that says zone 15 kitchen sliding door low battery um, but it will also let you know here on the keypad so that's not necessary uh, that's just one way to program it. Cancel report. Zero, zero. Star 70. This is a big one. Uh, if you have a fire system, this must be a one. If it is a burglary only, then it is not necessary and it can be a zero. So if you have any carbon monoxide, flood, fire, life, safety and you know important stuff like that you want to make sure and have this as a one uh, especially fire and what that will do is if there is a smoke detector that detects smoke sets off the fire alarm and then the air clears then it will also send a restoral signal to the central station um, after that happens or after you reset it depending on how it's programmed uh, so we are doing a burglary only system for this, uh, for the sake of this conversation. So that'll be zero. <clears throat> and then a trouble restore. Uh, we want to know that. So it's going to be one, zero. Bypass restore, zero, zero. We don't need to know if something's bypassed. Uh, AC restore, we didn't enable the AC reporting, so we don't need to know if it's restored. Zero, zero. Low battery restore. One, zero. We want to know if that backup power inside the Vista 20P 
uh, charges back up fully um, so we want that RF transmitter low battery restoral is star 75 so that's going to be a 1 0 test restore not necessary 0 0 77 daylight savings time you're going to put in 3 pound 11 for Eastern Standard Time and then 2 1 um, for the daylight uh, start and end weekend so 76 and 77 may uh, vary depending on where you're located make sure and look at your installation manual for those exact numbers that you want to put in there now we jump to 84 which we don't want to auto stay arm so we're going to do 0 85 0 86 cancel verify 0 87 miscellaneous faults 0 88 program mode lockout definitely 0 89 event log full 0 0 star 90 we want to enable the event log so we're going to do pound one five again that's star 90 pound one five star 91 options uh, typically this is going to be zero um, some options on that is if you are going to have a resistor inside your siren that will be a one and on older versions if you had total connect that would be a zero two on older versions the newer versions it comes enabled phone monitor definitely zero reports in armed period typically a good practice is two um, download through a telco we're going to do star nine four star and then any kind of ring count is going to be pound one five we'll pick up um, with star 91 on the next segment and that is what I kind of consider level 2 here what we just did of the Vista 20 programming um, this gets you through your trouble reports um, and some of your miscellaneous stuff and then after that we're going to talk about how to program Total Connect and additional keypads so stay tuned <laughs>